갑자기 내게 나타나준 너난 아무 말도 할 수가 없었지 첫눈에 반한다는 이야기가 널 보는 순간 이해가 됐어 매번 야야야야야 불러 널 야야 Hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel and this is Diva Super It's Organic so guys today i'm going to be showing you all how to dissolve your whitening powders according to your request yes i have been getting a lot of requests to teach you how to make a whitening how to dissolve your whitening powder so yeah i'm going to be showing you guys how to dissolve your whitening powders and if today is your first time of tuning into my youtube channel you are highly welcome please feel free to join the family subscribe turn on your notification bell and also subscribe to our other youtube channel for teaching for tips for review for vlogging and all that so guys so i have a uh, five type of whitening powders here that we are going to dissolve so <laughs> we are going to dissolve five type of whitening powders and here i have my snow white powder and here i have two powders i have the sepi white and i also have the sim white so the sepi white is below and the sim white is on top so i'm adding these two powders together because they dissolve well together they have their own ways that you can use to dissolve it so here i have two powders i have the alpha abutin and i also have the niacin amend so why did i add both of them together because both of them they actually dissolve well together yes they actually dissolve well together if you're buying your whitening powders make sure to read about it and make sure to ask your supplier what you can use to dissolve them so that you don't go make a very big mistake and at the end you're just going to throw your powders away or you're going to use it to make your skincare product and you're going to be having lumps on it yes you're going to be having lumps on it so here i have five powders two in one place two in one place and the snow white powder in another place so guys we have oil soluble powders this is oil soluble powders yes the sepi white and the sim white these are oil soluble powders and we also have the water soluble powders and we also have propylene glycol soluble powders so with your snow white powder you can dissolve it with your propylene glycol you can also use uh, glycerin but it will not dissolve well so here we have the niacinamide and the alpha abutin so this is water soluble powders yes your niacinamide and your alpha abutin these are water soluble powders we have so many powders that you can dissolve that you can use to make your skincare product that they have different ways of dissolving them yes so guys what i'm going to do now i'm going to dissolve my alpha abutin and my nasinamed powder like i said these are water soluble powders and you do not need heat to dissolve your nasinamed and your alpha abutin you do not need heat yes because it's going to dissolve so so easily without you doing the double boiling method or without you cooking it or anything so all you do you add your distilled water you can use your rose water if you have rose water you can use your hydrosol any hydrosol of your choice so you add your distilled water and you keep it aside it's going to dissolve in just one minute or two minutes it's going to come very very clear like your normal drinking water so when it comes to nursing a med and alpha abutin please take note do not dissolve it using the double boiling method if you add your water to your nursing a med and alpha abutin if it did not dissolve know that powders are fake just know those powders are fake so now i'm going to be dissolving the snow white powder so i have seen so many people they use um Tower's powder and they call it snow white powder guys Tower's powder is not snow white powder that is alum alum powder so this is original snow white powder this is a main when they said snow white powder this is snow white powder 
and you can use your propylene glycol to dissolve it and this snow white powder you have to use the double boiling method to dissolve it yes you have to use double boiling method to dissolve it if not it's not going to dissolve so the other powders that we are going to dissolve is the CFP white and the sim white and these are all soluble powders yes so i'm going to use oil to dissolve my CFP white and my snow white so with my CFP white and my sim white powder and you have to also do the double boiling method when it comes to CFP white and sim white you have to double boil it so that you can get all the powder to dissolve well yes guys so i'm going to add these two into my double boiling pot i'm going to be dissolving them using the double boiling method in a very low heat yes so guys this is my afa abutin and this is my uh, niacinamide powder just leave it in just one minute to two minutes they are going to dissolve pretty cool no need for double boiling okay no need for double boiling so that you don't key the potency of your nursing amed and your alpha abutin yes they are going to dissolve easily so guys now i'm going to put these two inside my double boiling method and you are going to see how it's going to dissolve so so easily without you stressing yourself and thinking why my powders did not dissolve if your powders are not dissolving know that you bought the wrong or you bought the fake powders yes you bought the wrong powders or you bought the fake powders so i'll be dissolving my sepi whites sim whites and my snow white powders yes So guys, can you see my Afa Abutin? It is really, really clear. Now, this is Afa Abutin and Nasina Med. You can actually drink your Nasina Med. Yes, I don't know about Afa Abutin, but your Nasina Med, you can drink it. So guys, now I'm going to put this inside my double boiling pots. This is how you do the double boiling method. This is the Sepi White and this is the Sim White and we are using oil to dissolve this so you just put on your gas and you see it's just going to keep dissolving little by little they are going to dissolve so so easily without stress and without any lumps so guys now this is my snow white powder that we dissolve with the propylene glycol so like i said before you also need the double boiling method to dissolve your snow white powder if not it's not going to dissolve so you can see that the solution is very very clear this is crystal clear there are no lumps on it there are no lumps on it and take note if you want to double boil or if you want to dissolve your powders please do not use any plastic uh, bowl or plastic plate because this plastic they are made with chemicals so always use a glass Use a glass to dissolve your powders. Do not use any plastic plate, okay? So, I'm going to bring down my oils. Yeah, this is my sepi white and this is the sim white. I'm just going to bring the camera close. So, this is it, guys. It has really dissolved so easily. No lumps, no lumps. So I wonder why most of you keep writing me, telling me that your powders are not dissolving. This is how you dissolve your powders. First thing you have to know, you have to know what you can actually use to dissolve your powders. If you're dissolving your sim white and you add your water to it, it's not going to dissolve. Or if you're dissolving your Nasina Med and your Afa Abutin and you add your oils to it, it's not going to dissolve. This is my Afa Abutin and Nasina Med. You can see the water is very, very clear. So I don't know why some people always complain that their powders are not dissolving. Always read the instruction on your powders. This is the Snow White. You can see there are no lumps. It's crystal, crystal clear. So you have to read 
the instructions on the powders, you have to ask your supplier, what will you use to dissolve your powders? If your supplier said use water, then you use water. If your supplier said use oils, then you use oil. And even some suppliers, they sell powders, but they don't even know what they actually use to dissolve those powders. So you have to go and do your own research. You have to read what you can actually use to dissolve your powders. So we have something like Giga White Powder. We have salicylic acid powder. We have retinol powder. We have so, so many powders. So in my next video, I'm going to show you all how you can dissolve those powders like salicylic acid, like retinol, like uh, Giga White. Those powders, I'm going to teach you how you can dissolve those powders. So here I have my uh, Nasinamide and the Afa Abuti dissolved in water. And the snow white powder dissolve in propylene glycol. And the sepi white and the seam white powder dissolve in oil. So that is what we call oil soluble, water soluble, and propylene glycol soluble. Yes, guys. So even the azalic acid, these powders, they don't have any stress in dissolving. Where you're going to have stress, if you want to dissolve powders that you can use to make acne cream, dark spots cream like powders like uh, uh, salicylic acid they are very hard to dissolve but i'm going to show you all how you can dissolve them in my other next video hope you find this video very helpful and i'm going to see you soon in my other next video and bye <laughs>